In the Oklahoma Newsroom, this is an OU update. I'm Jenny Carlson here with Jason Kersey. Jason, a lot of talk about Sooner quarterbacks, and rightfully so. Even in the offseason, Baker Mayfield getting ready to come back for one more year, but uh, he'll be joined by a couple newcomers, including Austin Kendall, who's a mid-season in, or mid-year enrollee as an uh, outcoming uh, high school player. But interesting that he's coming despite Kyler Murray's transfer. I mean, are you surprised at all that he decided to go ahead and keep that commitment to the Sooners? No, he's been committed for a long time and really uh, to OU. And all this Kyler Murray thing did really was make up for the fact that OU didn't sign a quarterback in the last class. And so uh, I wasn't really surprised, but I was surprised a little bit talking to Austin Kendall last week before he got to campus that um, Kentucky and Auburn both reached out to him after the Kyler Murray news to see if he'd be interested in flipping. And at that point, he had signed a financial aid agreement, but that's only, uh, that only binds the school to the player and not the other way around. So if he'd wanted to, he could have gone somewhere else. Yeah, definitely. So, well, this is really the first uh, recruit we've seen Lincoln Riley and his influence on. Are we going to see anything different out of a guy like Austin Kendall as opposed to quarterbacks of the past for the Sooners? I don't think so. I mean, I think that he's he's much more of a pocket passer maybe than Baker Mayfield or Kyler Murray are. Um, but he can move a little bit, and I, and I think he's sort of the guy that they uh, that they targeted early on in this class. And uh, Lincoln Riley was familiar with him being, you know, from his time at East Carolina. He put out some feelers, I think, to Austin Kendall when he was uh, maybe a high school what junior, I guess. Yeah. Um, but at that point, his recruitment was starting to take off and he was getting offers way bigger than East Carolina but once Lincoln Riley got to Oklahoma he reached back out to him and they were able to to, to make that work. Is it safe to say at this point that uh, Austin Kendall and Kyler Murray are basically going to be duking it out in the next year to try to establish where they are in the pecking order of, of these quarterbacks? I think so and I think uh, Cody Thomas is in there too and right. you know Cody Thomas has, has had very uh, he has had very good results when he's been in as a starter two years ago. Uh, and the fact, I think, that it took you know a long time for him to get to number two on the depth chart this year maybe says a lot, too. So uh, uh, Cody Thomas is a factor, but I think the job is going to be either Austin Kendall's or Kyler Murray's All in right. 2017. And we know you'll have a story on Austin Kendall coming up. People want to make sure to check that out in the Oklahoman and on NewsOK.com. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at NewsOK.com and every day in the Oklahoman.